All right, Shalom Akin. I want to start off by giving all praise to Yahweh Hashem Yahushua. Double honors to the apostles and elders at Great Millstone that rule well, and salutations to the hopeful elect that's pushing the word. It's sincerely and true for around the four corners of the earth. You know, and you know what I'm saying. And I just wanted to get into this uh quick video. You know what I'm saying about the tradition among men. All right, and you got uh you know even other parts of the government. You know what I'm saying that's bucking up at the government. You know what I'm saying. Of course, you know that the, that the police department. Is a part of the government, you know what I'm saying? And they're refusing Trump's order, you know, as it pertains to these immigrants, you know what I'm saying? But I'm going to play this video first. New York City, where the top cop is outright defying President Trump, Police Commissioner James O'Neill vowing not to enforce federal warrants for illegal immigrants. In an internal emo, or memo, he wants everyone, including illegal immigrants, to ask for help without hesitation, anxiety, or fear. As city officials have been at odds for months over the president's plan to slash federal funding from sanctuary cities like New York. Yeah, man. Hey, this second edge is 15 and 16. It says, for there shall be sedition among men and evading one another. They shall not regard their kings nor princes in the course of their actions to stand in their power. All right. And this is, this is an example of them not regarding their kings nor princes, man. All right. You got a damn police chief telling Trump, you know what I'm saying? We're not following your orders, man. All right. Hey, hey the scriptures tell you uh, if Satan's kingdom be divided against itself, how can it stand, man? All right. And this is an example of that, man. All right, so-called white man is bucking up against the so-called white man, all right? This whole kingdom is in disarray, you know what I'm saying? And and it's close to falling, man, all right? And at this point, if you can't see that America is about to fall, man, you just you just lost, man, all right? You got, once again, man, you got other parts of the government bucking up against the government, man, all right? So well, what is that going to bring forth, man? Trump to try to uh, so-called, you know what I'm saying, hammer down even more, man, all right? And that's gonna bring in them the foreign troops, cause you got Trump's, Trump's so called troops or or employees or what have you or aren't even listening to him, man. All right, they bucking up against him, man. So what's that gonna call call for? Those NATO troops to come in, man. All right, that's who's gonna be doing martial law, man. The foreign troops, cause as you can see, the American, not American troops, you know what I'm saying, but the American police department, they have a certain level of sympathy for the quote unquote American people. You know, even though the Northern Kingdom, you know what I'm saying, you Latins and Native Americans, aren't so-called Native Americans aren't really Americans, but you can see that sympathy there. You know what I'm saying? They're saying we're not going to do this to our people because uh, they're so-called Americans. You know what I'm saying? So that's what's going to cause those NATO troops to come in, man, those foreign troops, man. All right, And that's what's going to kick off martial law is those foreign troops because they're not going to have no sympathy for y'all. All right, So this is just a glimpse. You know what I'm saying? Of of Esau's kingdom, you know, uh, Satan standing against Satan, man. All right, Satan's kingdom being divided, man. All right, and Yahweh Shah said out his own mouth, if Satan's kingdom be divided, you know, how can it stand? All right, and the brothers in the know, we know that it's not going to stand anyway. But this is just another, you know, example or what you would call a hint from the Most High that this place is about to fall, man. All right, so I just want to do that quick video, man. Uh, I'm going to give all praise to Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shah. Double honors to the apostles and elders at Great Millstone that rule well, and salutations to the hopeful elect that's pushing the word and sustaining truth around the four corners of the earth. All right, Shalom, Akim.